Every editor has a different way of organizing projects. So this is by no means like the way to do it. This is just the way that I do it. This is a, the finished Private Life project, which is a film that I did two years ago now. You know, this is a finished project, not a not the beginning of a project. It would have been blank at the beginning. But the main features are that I have a folder for cuts and I have a folder for footage. Now the cuts folder will be empty until I cut anything. But even at the beginning, I know that the film will be broken up into reels. Now this is a throwback to when there were film reels and theoretically you don't even need to break a film up into reels nowadays because there's no physical reel of film, but the sound mixers and many of the other departments still work in reels, which are reduced, um, you know, 20 minutes of film at a time. And for me personally in the Avid, if I'm working with more than 20 minutes at a time in one timeline, it's too unwieldy. There's too many things that could go out of sync. So even before I start a film and these are empty, I like to break down the script. These are scene numbers, 1 through 19, 20 to 48, 49 through 78, etc. So that I know approximately how much of the script can, can be contained in a 20-minute reel. And as I get footage, I'll be building into um, a reel. That's cut. And then footage... The assistant um, will get the dailies and sync the dailies um, and will deliver to me scene bins. But before anything is even shot, he or she can break down the script by scene into folders and then start to have an idea of, of what the scene breakdown will be and how to label and name the scene bins.